Hi everybody, welcome to week four. We're at the halfway mark of our quick eight week term. I hope you're doing well. I'm sure you're very busy and I wanna help you keep your momentum going. So hopefully you'll find what we're doing this week exciting as we move forward with researching your topics of interest further. Um, we're going to be exploring books this week. There are several, actually many, many prints and ebooks available through Neely Library as well as your local libraries, as I'm sure you can imagine. Before we get started with all that, though, I just wanted to take this opportunity to do a little show and tell and share with you one of my favorite bookstores. It's in Los Angeles and it's called The Last Bookstore. It's in downtown LA. This is a picture of the book tunnel that is inside the last bookstore. You can actually walk through this book tunnel. This is on the second floor of the bookstore. You'll see um, the door on the right here. I guess this building used to be an old bank and this is an old vault door and there's actually a book collection inside those doors. Just a little fun fact there. If you ever want to talk about favorite bookstores, feel free to email me. I always love talking about different bookstores around the country and even around the world. This week, you'll be working through Module 4 to learn more about how to find and utilize books effectively for your research. Uh, we're going to be in Module 4, and you're going to start with an inspiring TED Talk by Lisa Boo about how books can open your mind. You will be reflecting on her TED Talk through a journal entry, and then we'll actually move into some of the mechanics behind utilizing library book catalogs and classification systems like that of Library of Congress and Dewey Decimal. So you'll find tutorials here and um, handouts that you can use to reference uh, for your work this week and you can come back to it of course later anytime you are looking for books. You'll be watching a short tutorial I created on how to navigate the Neely Library Catalog to find books and other kinds of library materials for your research and then you're going to be watching a more extensive um, video lecture by SAC librarian Jackie King, who explains uh, more about our book catalog functionality, how you can use it effectively for your own research topics. Also, she explains how you can use different parts of a book to more effectively uh, locate and utilize the information within the book. So I think you'll find this very helpful, not only for the assignments you have this week, but just any time you're needing to use books to find information on a topic. And then you have a Finding Books assignment that is actually due Friday because the discussion assignment following this asks you to post about the book that you selected for your topic. So you do want to have this done by Friday. Uh, so that you have enough time to share in the Bookshare discussion forum and respond to two of your classmates. There are very detailed instructions as usual for all of these tasks and assignments, so please read through everything very carefully. If at any point when you're trying to find the print or ebooks on your topic that you're being asked to find, Please don't hesitate to reach out to me if you would like research assistance, if you're running into walls or difficulty. And of course, you should always feel free to see the librarian at your local library's reference desk. So you can use the SAC Neely Library for your assignments this week, or you are very welcome to also use at another local library to complete these assignments. And finally, there's information here about SAC's Book of the Year for 2017-2018. The book is titled One World, a Global Anthology of Short Stories. You can read more about it here and learn more about some campus events going on around the book. So I hope you have a really great week, and I hope you enjoy exploring 
books related to your, your chosen research topic. Thank you.